Hello everyone, this is the Ami Diamond from SharePoint Wizard. In this episode, I'd like to show you uh, two functionalities within the planner. Uh, one is to add the whole plan to an Outlook calendar. And the second one is to how to add my tasks that are assigned to me also to uh, Outlook calendar. So let's start. I'm now in the Teams uh, planner app, but it's also available on the web. So what we see here is this is my day, but if I go to uh, my plans, I can go to one of the plans. And actually, if I uh, click on this drop down, I will see add plan to Outlook calendar. Once we do this, we see that the first option is don't publish, keep private. And if we click for publish, it will be shared for everyone. So one, um, a uh, reminder is actually, uh, it says that if anyone has this link, they will have access. So you need to be aware um, to share the link very uh, securely. So once we had also a button here to add to Outlook, for some reason it doesn't exist. So what I will do is I will just copy this. Um, now what I will do is go to the Outlook web. I will go to the calendar and I will click on add calendar. Here I will choose subscribe from web. I will enter this URL. I'll give it a name. Let's call this plan one. I can choose a color and a charm and I can choose where I want to add it. So let's add it to other calendars. I will click import and now I should see, if I go now to my calendar, I have plan one. I can mark it if it's not marked. And here we go. And you see here, I see uh, all of the tasks I have. Um, as you notice, I can see the progress status, the checklist. And if I click on it, I can uh, go to the planner item. Um, now, uh, remind me later to tell you something about the status because I found out if you change uh, the status, then for some reason it doesn't update uh, directly. Okay, so up until now we saw that uh, the whole plan was actually uh, added and we can see here actually uh, in, in green these uh, tasks. So um, now let's try to add uh, tasks that are assigned to me. So what I need to do is actually go to my tasks. And if I'm in the all, I need to choose assigned to me. You see some tasks I have in the plan project management, the other demo army plan, another one in employee onboarding. And if I go to the three dots here, I will now see a new functionality, add, assign to me to Outlook. So I will click on this. Again, I can choose to publish. The URL will be created. I will copy it. And I again, I will go to, to the Outlook. I will click, go to the calendar, add a calendar, subscribe from web and here I will write tasks uh, my tasks here yeah. I'll choose a different color and uh, let's choose a charm <coughs> and let's keep it on other calendar and I will click import now everything is closed let's see you see these red ones are actually the ones that are assigned to me. Um, as you can see, if I go in, I can see uh, more details. Now let's just test what happens is. So if I, as you can see here, um, for instance, today, there's a, a document scope management plan and it's not started. Let me try to change this uh, status document scope 
and I will now change the status to in progress. So it's in, in, in progress here and if I now click on uh, this thing it hasn't changed. Now maybe it updates once in a while but I'm not sure uh, if it does that. Let's try to do something different. Let's move the date to a different date. So instead of the 12th, let's move it to the 13th. This should be uh, important. If it doesn't update, then we're, then it's not that good. So uh, let's try to refresh here. Hopefully it should be moved. Currently I see it hasn't moved. But uh, hopefully it will uh, be updated very soon. So let me just go in. Uh, this is the thing that which I'm checking. But uh, you need to follow and see if it's something that will be updated. Maybe it's hourly, maybe it's daily, or maybe uh, this is how it is. So let me just refresh and see if it's something which will change. This is on the 12th. Let's go here. And this is on the 13th. Maybe I need to refresh as well this thing. This is the 13th. Now, just to show you something cool, you have the quick look, which here you can see all kinds of things. You can see the checklist. You can see here.